Hi, I'm Anthony Savage from Aussie Environmental and today we're going to show you how to install coir logs correctly. Coir logs are tubes filled with densely packed coconut fibre which are wrapped in coir netting. Coir logs are lightweight and easy to install. They are ideal for retaining structures, re-establishing vegetation, managing water flow velocity and garden edging. So here we have some soil erosion from a rain event. The reason we've installed the coir logs here is to stop the concentrated flow of water running down and to catch the sediment. The vegetation will eventually take hold, but in the meantime we've got coir logs here to sort of support that. Tools you'll need to install coir logs are timber stakes, small or large sledgehammer and shovel if trenching is required. When installing coir logs, best practice is to dig a trench with a shovel or a mattock to ensure water does not flow underneath the coir log. Dig the trench 125mm deep in sandy soils and 75mm deep in clay soils. Next step is to place the coir log in the trench, compact the disturbed soil and place the timber stakes in the three pre-drilled holes. Then hammer the timber stakes in flush with the coir log and your coir log is installed. Coir logs can be left in situ as they are biodegradable and will biodegrade over time, typically between two to three years. Thanks for watching this tutorial video. If you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe.